I am in a long distance relationship. We've been together for a year and four months. It's it's been absolutely wonderful. Um, I love him to death. He is a big foundation of support in my life. Um, honestly, I couldn't have asked for anyone better or a better relationship. He He's very loyal and very honest, actually. We've never had a problem with lying to each other. Um, if anything, I would be more likely to lie than he would be. I've never lied. I don't think I ever have. And if I have, it's it would have been something small like, oh, I can't call the night because I'm sick and I really was just tired or I wanted to watch Netflix instead. You know, there might be days where I'm a little bit annoyed at him and I really don't want to talk so I'll say, hey, you know, I've got a migraine, I'm going to go to bed and I actually stay up and watch Netflix. If anything, that's the extent of my lying. Um, we don't, we try not to keep anything from each other and we've um, definitely had times where things have come out and um, it's, it's always good afterwards when we tell each other what's been going on. Um, Lately, I've been dealing with some anxiety problems, some depression problems, and I, when I finally told him, um, it upset him that I had been keeping it from him. So, I guess that is deception in a way, but um, other than that, we've never had a problem with lying directly to each other. Um, I've never suspected him of cheating, and he's never done it's just suspected me of the same, and I don't think I ever will. He's... Um, I've got him wrapped around my finger and he's got uh, me wrapped around his so I couldn't imagine being with anyone else so cheating has never crossed my mind or breaking up with him because I'm in college he's a senior in high school so a lot of people have asked me that but I I have no intention and neither of us go partying so there's never there's never suspicion there um, in relationships some people might lie or um, there might be deception in that someone might be cheating, um, someone might be lying to them to get away with cheating, and that's, these are obviously bigger issues, <laughs> classic, I'm lying, I'm, I'm staying late at work, you know, but you're actually not. Um, some might lie to go out partying, I've known people that have done that, um, you know, they promised their girlfriend or their boyfriend, I'm not gonna go out and party, you know, I'm not gonna go out and get drunk, um, but they do, and they'll lie about it, um, and I don't know why, but, uh, well, I do, I understand why, but, um, I kn I've known people that have done that, um, I've all, whenever, <clears throat> sorry, I have, um, only been to two parties since I've been here, and they weren't anything crazy, wild, um, and, but every time, both times, I've told him, you know, like, just to let you know, I'm going to a party, there might be drinking, you know, just to warn him. Um, so he feels comfortable, and I text him most nearly the entire time of the party. So <clears throat> there is some trust. There is a lot of trust there. Um, but I, I don't really go partying, and if I do, I tell him. And he will do the same for me if, if he goes and parties. <clears throat> That's not like him, but he might. You never know. Um, you also might... This can go for any relationship. Parent to child, um, friend to friend, uh, boyfriend or girlfriend... Um, you might lie to keep from, you might lie to keep the other person from having hurt feelings, such as, like, you, you hear something about them, but you're in a lie and say, no, like, this person never said that about you, you're fine, or, um, I can't really think of anything else that you would lie to keep the other person from being hurt, um, other than that, really, because that's happened to me, um, but that could be beneficial. I don't really know why that would be beneficial. I personally like to know the truth, if you like me or not, and I don't really like it when people sugarcoat it. Um, and last, I don't think deception could ever be positive in a relationship. There's no way. Um, all I see are a lot of negative side effects, and um, while the deception that I faced in our relationship was not telling my boyfriend that, you know, I'd been dealing with anxiety and depression. Um, afterwards, it felt positive to tell him, but in the moment, it's never, it never feels good to say I'm doing fine when I'm really not. Um, and it hurt, it, it, it didn't hurt him. It made him really sad that I didn't tell him. So 
there, I don't think there's anything positive with uh, deception in relationships. So, um, I've never seen anything positive come out of that. And I've known people that have been through deceptive relationships and nothing positive has come out of that.